I was not used to the 35 cameras. I use this camera called the red camera. Yeah. And it shoots like. Yeah, but it's not probably not going to be Oh, it's not. Okay, so just. No, it's actually, it's warm. This ring is not. I'm killing me. This out. Can I smiley? Yeah, yeah, we're happy. Happy thoughts. Happy thoughts. Happy thoughts. Happy thoughts. <laughs> like, yeah. Why well, do we have a shadow in there? Okay. I like her black. Her. Uh, it looks very pretty. Huh? Yeah. Oh, you're Oh, that hanger's not fully Then that needs to go next to Mine's got pads strapped. Oh, one second, one second. Oh, my fault. I should know better. Um, Too much action, we can't get it all. <laughs> Are you done with these girls? These. But they must be strapped. Oh, I don't, yeah, I don't want I don't them. Them. You don't need them. I don't want them in there. Hold on. Jessica, look over your shoulder. There we go. There we go. That's the shot. And Caitlin, when you're done with that, I'll have them move. Alright. Yeah. Look at her. I can't be that one. Put your dress on. I'm gonna put your pretty dress on. Uncle Richie, are you gonna be taking it? I know you, pretty girl. You wanna go see something? Yep, this is going in your hair. I'll release them one by one. Come on, come in. To get laced. Come on, come on. 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 I hope so. Are you looking? Oh, yeah, that's it. Um, <laughs> all right, I'm ready. In the shadow, then. Seems like I always would have problems with that. Carol's distracted. Can you see what she did with her headdress? I don't know. 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 I don't Right here. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Hey, just, just come in. Oh my god, I can't sit in this freaking thing. That's how I am. That's the photographer's. Pleasure to meet you guys. There he is. Yeah. Come on, you want to watch TV? Can I What's going on, guys? Oi! <laughs> <laughs> Oi! We're going to Tim. Um, Let's play the volume go off. Yeah. It's really annoying. So I was like, oh, I'm okay. Me. I had one of those koi fish things. Right. Oh, this feels good. Yeah. Dying. Oh, <laughs> like, yeah. so, and it was really just a flash. Like, that one's one. Right Side of the truck road. Who lost some pulls over here? Yeah. I don't want that on myself. You can.
Yeah, no, I go for this will tell you. Good evening, everyone, and please be seated. So I wish you all, all a warm welcome on the sacred occasion of Jessica and Kevin's wedding day. It is truly a blessing from heaven for two people to find one another and to love so deeply that they embrace the holy bond of marriage. That is why we are all here today to witness and to celebrate Jessica and Kevin's commitment to their union. So on behalf of them, I welcome you all. Jessica and Kevin, we rejoice for out of the entire world, you have chosen each other and you are experiencing the deeper meaning and richness of life and sharing it with each other. Your future with its hopes and its dreams and successes is hidden from your eyes today. Love will make it easy. Acceptance and forgiveness and respecting each other and always listening to each other, these are the things that will make it a joy. So may then this love in which you hold your hands and your hearts never fail yet grow even deeper and stronger as the years go on. You are adding to your life not only the affection that your heart desires, not only the happy companionship of time spent together, but a deep trust and consideration for one another as well. You are agreeing not only to work out your own challenges, but also to assist one another. You are finding in each other that which complements your life. You are entering in now on an act of pure faith in which you give of yourselves to the utmost. So into this state of marriage, the two of you now come to be united. So now let us all close our eyes and bring to mind our loved ones who could not be present with us today. Although they are absent physically, they are with us in spirit. And we invoke through our thoughts and prayers their loving presence. 
Amen. So Kevin and Jessica, please face each other now. Hold each other's hands and look deeply now into each other's eyes. Do you, Kevin, take this woman, Jessica, as your wife to love her and honor her, to nurture, serve, and support her in times of joy and in times of difficulty? Do you promise to remain by her side regardless of what trouble befalls you? And in the presence of temptation to forsake this love, do you promise to remain steadfast and true? Do you promise with all your heart and soul to honor this vow till death do you part? If so, please answer, I do. I do. Okay. I do. <laughs> Make sure everyone heard that. And do you, Jessica, take this man, Kevin, as your husband, to love him and to honor him, to nurture, serve, and support him in times of joy and in times of difficulty? Do you promise to remain by his side regardless of what trouble befalls you? And in the presence of temptation to forsake this love, do you promise to remain steadfast and true? Do you promise with all your heart and soul to honor this vow until death do you part? If so, please say, I do. I do. So together now recite after me. From this day forward. From, from this day forward. You shall not walk alone. You, you shall, shall not walk, walk alone. alone. My heart shall be your shelter. My heart, heart shall be your shelter. shelter. And my arms shall be your home. And my arms shall, shall be your home. May you feel deeply loved. May you, you feel, feel deeply, deeply loved. For indeed you are. For, for indeed you are. are. You are my best friend. You are, you are my, my best, best friend. friend. My lover. My lover. And my beloved. And my beloved. I feel so blessed. I feel, I feel so blessed. blessed to spend my life with you. To spend my life with you. I feel so honored. I feel so I feel honored. So honored. <laughs> to call you mine. To call you mine. I give to you this day. I give to you this day. A promise of my love. A promise of my love. As we go forth. As we go forth. Blessed by God. Blessed by God. With everlasting love. With everlasting love. As husband and wife. As husband and wife. So Kevin and Jessica, you have now vowed your love to each other. Are you now ready to confirm that love and the responsibilities of a marriage? If so, both say yes. 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 So Anthony, may Kevin and Jessica have the rings, please. So the circle has long been a symbol of spirit and the power of God. The sky and the earth are round. The wind with its greatest power whirls. The sun and moon both round come forth and go down again in a circle. Even the seasons form a great circle in their changing and always come back again to where they were without beginning or end and without any point of weakness. The circle is a reminder of the eternal quality of God and of unending strength. Let the seamless circle of these rings become the symbol of your endless love and unending faithfulness. Your wedding rings are most special because they say that even in your uniqueness, you have chosen to be bonded, to allow the presence of another human being to enhance who you are. Your rings carry a potent double message. We are individuals, and yet we belong. We are not alone. As you wear them through time, they will reflect not only who you are, but also the glorious union that you are now creating. So God bless these rings and the two who exchange them. Fill them with your holy presence. Keep them safe in the circle of your protection and love. Amen. So Kevin, look into Jessica's eyes. And as you're about to place this ring on Jessica, I now ask you, do you take this woman to be your lawful wedded wife? Do you promise God, Jessica, and all of us here that th from this point forward to support her and nourish her and to love and respect and honor her for the rest of your days on earth? 
If so, please answer, I do. I do. And Jessica, as you place the ring on Kevin, I now ask you, do you, do you take this man as your lawful wedded husband? Do you promise God, Kevin, and all of us here that from this point forward, to support him and nourish him, and to love and respect and honor him for the rest of your days on earth? If so, please answer, I do. I do. Making sure it's not coming off. There we go. Okay. <laughs> so you can hold each other's hands. So now we have now heard the vows that you have made to each other. And now may your love and understanding grow throughout the years. May you seek each other's happiness and recognize each other's needs as though they were your own. May yours always be a shared adventure, rich with moments of serenity as well as excitement marked with a sense of personal freedom as well as mutual responsibility. May you find in each other companionship as well as love, understanding as well as compassion, and challenge as well as agreement. May your home be an island where the pressures of the world could be sorted out, brought into focus, and healed. Where personal needs do not tower over concern for each other, where the immediate does not blur more distant goals, and where the warmth of humor always puts life into perspective. And above all, may you find an ever richer meaning and joy in the high adventure of lifelong loving and growing together. So Kevin and Jessica, today in the presence of God, your family and your friends, you have spoken the words and performed the rites which unite your lives. It is my legal right as a minister and my greatest joy and privilege to now declare you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. W. So ladies and gentlemen, it is with great honor and pleasure I present to you for the first time ever, Mr. and Mrs. Kevin Graham. No, we're so fixed. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.